Hello and welcome to another video by Day Night Gaming. In today's video, we'll be leveling Leather Worker from levels 15 to 35. Now, before we begin, we're going to need to buy a few materials from the FC material supplier, starting with 6 beast sinew, 3 cotton yarn, and 6 iron ingot. And also at the market board, we're going to need to buy 6 aldergoat leather, as well as 6 hard leather, and the following high quality materials 12 high quality aldergoat leather, and 15 high quality toad leather. So now that we're level 15, I'm going to show you the gear that I use. Please keep in mind that it is over melded, but it is in no way required I'm only showing you what the best of the best gear can look like and along with the gear I'm also going to be eating a high quality blood bullet safe food and I'm going to show you the high quality craftsman syrup that I used now please keep in mind I'm showing you all these different things so you can pick and choose what works best for you so if you don't want to over meld you can instead supplement those stats with the high quality food and the high quality syrup just take note that regardless of the path that you take I highly recommend that everything be high quality so here we are at Gontrant the Levmet in Gridania and we're going to be picking up the level 15 Lev quest known as Heads Up and it's going to require us to make high quality hard leather skull caps. So we're going to be making three of these in total because we're going to be doing this Lev quest three times and we're going to be turning these into Macenta. So we're going to start off by using Inner Quiet and what this is going to do is it's going to give us a stack every time we use a quality enhancing ability and for each subsequent quality enhancing ability it's going to increase the amount that it yields and now we're going to use six basic touch in a row so one and then two three four five and six and now we're at 10 durability, so we're gonna have to use Master's Men to get some back. And that's gonna bring us to 40 durability, which leaves us room for two more basic touch. So we're gonna go ahead and do that now. And for me personally, where I'm at right now, I only need to do one, but we have room for two. So if your stats are a bit lower than mine, you can go ahead and do that. So one, and then I would use another one and that would bring us down to 20 durability normally. So then we can use veneration and we can do two more basic synthesis. Basic synthesis number one should bring us to 39 progress and then the last one should cap us out. There we go. Now we've made a high quality hard leather skull cap. And we're gonna turn this into Macenta. So now that we've finished crafting our hard leather skull cap, we're gonna head to Macenta at the Black Rabbit Traders and turn it in. So item request, select the high quality hard leather skull cap, hand over, and do you really wanna trade a high quality item? Yes. So now we need to head back to the Adventures Guild and speak to Contrant the Levmet. And just like previously, we're gonna grab the Lev quest known as Heads Up, and we're gonna craft another high quality hard leather skull cap. And just like before, we're gonna use the same rotation on this one. So inner quiet into six basic touch, followed by a master's mend, then another two more basic touch, veneration, and finishing off with two basic synthesis. So now that we've finished crafting our hard leather skull cap, we're gonna head to Macenta at the Black Rabbit Traders and turn it in. So item request, select the high quality hard leather skull cap, hand over, and do you really wanna trade a high quality item? Yes. So now we need to head back to the Adventures Guild and speak to Contrant the Levmet. And just like previously, we're gonna grab the Lev quest known as Heads Up, and we're gonna craft another high quality hard leather skull cap. And just like before, we're gonna use the same rotation on this one. So inner quiet into six basic touch, followed by a master's mend, then another two more basic touch, veneration, and finishing off with two basic synthesis. So here we are again at Macenta, and we're gonna be turning in our last high quality hard leather skull cap, and this should get us above level 20, and most likely very close to level 21. So for levels 20 to 25, we won't be upgrading our gear because we won't actually be crafting anything in these five levels. So here we are at Gontrant and we're gonna get the level 20 Lev quest known as Fire and Hide. And we're gonna be turning in those high quality Aldegoat leathers that we purchased earlier on in the video. So here we are back at Macenta, the Black Rabbit Traders. 
and we're gonna be turning in our Aldigo leathers, but make sure there's the high quality version. And now we're doing a triple turning quest. So it's gonna ask us if we wanna submit additional items. So we're gonna click yes and submit. And once again, make sure that you're turning in the high quality version and then hand over. And then we're gonna do it one more time for a total of three times. And while the EXP gained by this level quest is actually quite small, the relatively low amount of guild that's spent for these levels makes this level quest very appealing. So we're going to have to do this lev quest three more times, totaling four times total. So all in all, that means we're going to be using 12 high quality Aldgoat leathers to get a total of five levels, which is extremely efficient. So now back to the Adventures Guild, we're going to speak to Gontrent and reacquire the level 20 lev quest Fire and Hide. So now we're back at Macenta at the Black Rabbit Traders and we'll be turning in three more high quality Aldegoat leathers. So now back to the Adventures Guild, we're going to speak to Gontrent and reacquire the level 20 Lev Quest Fire and Hide. So now we're back at Macenta at the Black Rabbit Traders and we'll be turning in three more high quality Aldegoat leathers. So now back to the Adventures Guild, we're going to speak to Gontrent and reacquire the level 20 Lev Quest Fire and Hide. So now we're back at Macenta at the Black Rabbit Traders and we'll be turning in three more high quality Aldegoat leathers. And after doing so, we should barely be into level 25. Alright, that should do it. Yep, level 25. So now let's head back to the Adventurers Guild and get our next set of lev quests. So this is the gear that I used for the level 25 bracket. And once again, please keep in mind that it is not required to use this gear. And if you do not want to copy the overmills that I used for this gear, you can supplement your stats with high quality food and high quality craftsman syrup. So here we are at Gontrant, the lev mat. And we're going to be accepting the level 25 lev quest known as Belt Served Cold. And we're going to be making high quality Voyager's belts. So for this craft, I'm going to be eating high quality Blood Bulise as well as drinking high quality cunning craftsman syrup but please remember i'm only eating these foods so i can show you examples of what you can do instead of over melding the gear so we're going to be doing the same rotation that we used earlier and we're going to be starting off with inner quiet and then we're going to be doing Six basic touch, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and now we're at tender ability, so we're going to use Master Men to get some of that back, bringing us up to 40. And then we're going to be doing two more basic touch, so one. Two. and then we're gonna go with veneration and then we're gonna finish off with two basic synthesis so one and our final one and that should high quality uh, Voyager's built even though there's a triple turn in quest we're only gonna make one for now and then we're gonna head to Macenta and turn this quest in so that we can level up to 26 the reason for this is because this is actually a very hard craft so unless you have the absolute very best gear there is a chance albeit very small that you create a normal quality instead of a high quality so here we are and now that we've turned in one we should hit level 26 and at this point it should be much easier to 100% high quality quality going forward. So we're going to make two more so we can finish off this current live quest. So just like before, we're going to be using the same rotation. Inner Quiet into six basic touch and then Master's Mend, then followed by two basic touch of Veneration and ending off with two basic synthesis.
So now we're gonna speak to Macenta and turn in our final two Voyager's belt for this left quest to finish it off. So here we are back at Gontrant the Levement, and once again we're going to grab the level 25 lev quest known as Belt Served Cold, and we're going to make three more high quality Voyager's belts to turn in. So just like before we're going to be using the same rotation, Inner Quiet into 6 Basic Touch and then Master's Mend, then followed by 2 Basic Touch. A veneration and ending off with two basic synthesis. So here we are back at Macenta and we're going to be turning these three high quality Voyager's belts and after this quest we should be well into level 30. So once again, we will not be upgrading our gear for this level 30 to 35 level bracket because once again, we won't actually be crafting anything. And instead, we're going to be turning in our high quality toad leathers that we purchased earlier from the market board. So now that we're at the Levmet, we're going to be accepting the level 30 lev quest known as Best Serve Toad. And it's going to require us to turn in high quality toad leathers. And we're going to be repeating this quest five times in order to get to level 35. So here we are at Macenta and we're going to be turning in our three high quality toad leathers. And just like previously, even though the experience yield is low, the gill spent versus EXP gained is actually really high, making this lev quest quite favorable. So here we are back at the Adventures Guild speaking to Gontran and we're going to be accepting the quest Best Serve Toad again. So here we are again at Macenta and we're going to turn in our three high quality toad leathers. So here we are back at the Adventures Guild speaking to Gontran and we're going to be accepting the quest Best Serve Toad again. So here we are again at Macenta and we're going to turn in our three high quality toad leathers. So here we are back at the Adventure Guild speaking to Gontran and we're going to be accepting the quest Best Serve Toad again. So here we are again at Macenta and we're going to turn in our three high quality toad leathers. So here we are back at the Adventure Guild speaking to Gontran and we're going to be accepting the quest Best Serve Toad again. So here we are again at Macenta and we're going to turn in our three high quality toad leathers. And 
this final turn in should get us to 35 and there we go thank you i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please consider smashing that thumbs up button uh, hit that subscribe and ring that bell uh, for notifications on future videos that i might be posting and until next time take care goodbye